We are in Harrisburg, Pennsylvania at this gorgeous six bedroom Airbnb that has one of the most incredible views out there. We are not only gonna give you a tour of this place, but we're also gonna show you some of the can't miss spots in the area while hanging out with some of our closest friends. Right when you walk through the front door of this Airbnb, you can either go upstairs or down to the main floor. So I'm gonna show you the main floor first. When you come down this hallway, it opens up into the living room with the best view out all of these sliding glass doors. It is truly amazing. This living room has a couple of couches and comfortable chairs with a fireplace and a TV. And let me tell you, that fireplace puts off plenty of heat to keep this little space warm. Right off the living room is a door to downstairs as well as a half bath that is shared for the whole first floor. Let's go into the master bedroom. In here, you've got a comfortable king bed as well as a little seating area with its own personal fireplace. I love that there are closets on either side that actually connect around the back so there's plenty of place to hang all your clothes and put your stuff. Plus, the best part of this room is that view with all these sliding glass doors and it goes out onto the front porch. So this is the master bathroom with a couple of skylights making it really bright and beautiful in here. They've got a large tub and a stone shower with a double vanity. Let's keep going, there is so much more to show you. By the way, if you're a host with a unique and amazing Airbnb and want us to feature your place, you can reach us at journeymore.com by filling out our contact form. We would love to work with you. So right past the living room, you've got this beautiful dining room area with plenty of seating for all your friends and family. And then behind me is the massive kitchen with lots of counter space and genuinely everything you could possibly need to cook a delicious master meal. So up these steps is my favorite room in this whole place. It's the library. It's the perfect spot to grab a book, cozy up, and just enjoy the view and this place. Right off the kitchen, they've got a little breakfast nook as well as a room over here that has a seating area with a pull-out couch. And right next to it is a laundry room. On the back side of the kitchen, there is a door that leads to a double car garage. We've never had a garage at an Airbnb before and it is truly awesome. Let's go upstairs. At the top of the stairs, you come up to this balcony that overlooks the living room and another little cozy spot with some chairs. And on this side, there are a couple of bedrooms. In here, you have a king bed with a little secret passageway that leads to another nook. So there's a lot of places to get away in this Airbnb. We'll move into the bathroom that is shared with the next bedroom. This Jack and Jill bathroom has two vanities as well as a tub and a shower. And then this bedroom also has a king bed with an incredible view out a couple of windows. There's plenty of space to store your stuff and a cute little seating spot. On this side of both of those rooms, there's access to the spiral staircase that leads to the first floor and all the way to the basement. So let's go there. Also, if you're enjoying this video, please like it and subscribe to our YouTube channel. We wanna bring you along on all our Airbnbs and adventures. So down here, there's a couple more bedrooms, starting with this one that has a king bed, a little seating area with a TV, and the best part is this floor actually has access out the front into the yard. So you have a sliding glass door with a couple of chairs outside, perfect for enjoying that view and hanging out. Continuing down the hall, there's a full bath off this side that is shared between all the bedrooms down here. This next bedroom, again has a king bed and sliding glass doors that you can go out onto a little porch seating area. Let's keep going back this way. So off to this side, they have a little kitchenette and then it opens up into the downstairs living space. This is the perfect spot to hang out and have fun because they have a pool table and plenty of games. So we'll definitely be using this little spot with our friends. And then the last bedroom is over here. So this is the last bedroom. It's like a little den bedroom that has a king bed and then an extra double bed. So if you bring your kiddos along, this is the perfect room. And then this door leads into the second laundry room and then it keeps going outside to the hot tub, which Hayden is gonna show you along with everything else outside. The prop 
property that this cabin sits on is absolutely gorgeous and tons of great spots to enjoy this amazing view. This porch here has multiple seating areas along with multiple tables so everybody can be out here at once. And then down below on the underneath part of the deck, you've obviously got that beautiful hot tub and then two seating areas leading out from the bedrooms. Now I'm gonna show you what I feel is one of the best parts of this Airbnb right off of the breakfast nook you've got a side porch it has a little seating area and a grill but the best part is this ramp that goes right down to the driveway the host wanted to make this a handicap accessible space so everything on the first floor when you come in through this side door is accessible for anyone that's handicapped now let's go out to the driveway i've got a few more things to show you off to my right they have a half basketball court perfect spot for getting the kids out here and getting them active and then by Behind the basketball court, up in the woods, they actually have a trail that follows the ridge of the property. This is about eight acres total, so you've got a little bit of distance there and a lot of space to really explore and enjoy the beauty that is here. Over here is the last thing. This is the beautiful fire pit area with plenty of seating and a special view out this side of the property. This place is perfect for large groups, whether it be friends and family or even retreats. The host told us that they actually had 25 people stay here one time, and that would be a lot of fun. If you wanna book this place, we'll leave a link in the description below, but the video is not over yet. We're gonna show you a lot of great places in Harrisburg, Pennsylvania, as we're hanging out with all of our friends. Oh, cooking dinner, the boys are doing brats, the girls are doing sweet potato fries, and Pearson is starting the fire for us so we can enjoy a delicious meal and then hang out after. further, I think it is time to quickly introduce our crew. First, we have two of Hayden's closest friends, Alex and Ben. Then, Ben's lovely wife, Kaylee, Hayden's awesome younger sister, Carson, and one of Carson's best friends, Pearson. Today we are headed to Broad Street Market, which is one of the oldest continuously working farmers markets in the US. And then after that, we're headed to Hershey Park for some of the best roller coasters in Pennsylvania. This is like one of the best things you've ever had. Really? That, this is actually incredible. It's pretzel bread with steak, egg, and cheese. The glaze? Okay, 
Okay, I'll just lay. I got donuts. That is the maple bacon donut. Real good? Not good? Yes. I wish this is where we lived because they've got a lot of good food. <laughs> What'd you think? I love it. I got a bunch of treats for my dog. I got some toffee. I got five giant donuts for $5. So Carson and the boys are headed to the amusement park, Hershey Park, and then me and Kaylee have stopped for some tea at a local shop. So we are going to hang out today and find our own adventure. Let's go! Go, 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 go! Let's go. Sure. Let's go. Let's go, baby. <laughs> oh, baby. Okay, Woo! how was it? Awesome. How was it, Alex? Woo! That one might be the best ride we ride today. my least favorite so far. Wow, I can't bear After that information. five coasters, it's at the bottom. I'm coming in to tell you that it was a six out of 10 and I smiled maybe twice. We decided to go for a little walk across this bridge to see all the older homes and the pretty architecture. So that's what we're doing for now. the best one? For sure. For best one, Alex, hey. right? 100. Hershey Park was so much fun today. All of the rides were incredibly intense and fast and it was beautiful while we were there. It is a must do if you come stay here. And Kaylee and I loved our time in downtown Harrisburg, walking around and seeing the town. So this is a perfect place for adventure junkies or people like me who just wanna take a nice stroll. We love this place, it's incredible. Please don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel. We would love to take you along, but for now, that's a wrap.